Noel Marshall back here with you, this time in turbo mode as I build a flower bed stroke fish pond. It's a simple project but can be very beautiful when properly integrated into your garden or patio. Now don't necessarily follow the same shape and design as I'm building here. The thing you got to do is to build it to a suitable size and shape to match the area in which you're going to place it in your home. To help you do that, lay the first course of bricks out on the ground without using mortar. This then will help you to visualize and decide what shape and size best suits your area. After you have decided on a shape and size, the same principles as always apply. Lay the first course level and keep the corner vertically level as you build up. Again, apply the mason's mate to check for alignment. I'm laying block here at the back as these won't be seen after it's filled up. In fact, if you're building it against your house or any other concrete wall, you won't need a back wall. And the pro pointer to give us that perfect finish. Again notice I'm using a black dye in the mortar as this gives that great finish. And I'm also using rustic bricks, which are in fact brand new just manufactured to give that aged rustic look which personally I really like. Here you see me putting in a solid plastic fish pond. These are got at all major garden centres. So we place a nice capping on it. We'll plant a few shrubs. Now again, it's to your own taste. I'm going to put in a few fish. And once it's kept clean, it's a beautiful feature that lasts a lifetime. So it's goodbye for now, but may I wish you the very best in all your constructive endeavours. I'll welcome any feedback, questions, or oh, and especially pictures of your completed projects. You'll get me via my website, bricky.com.